welcome to our 27th vlog with Floor Carver Technologies. I'm Emily. And I'm David. This week, we'll talk about what to do after a storm if your house is flooded. If your house is flooded because of storm waters, in most cases, this is not a DIY project. Hidden moisture undetected can create problems weeks or months later, and that is called secondary damage. Basically, it's damage that was not directly related to the initial loss, and you don't want that. First, and very important, flood waters resulting from hurricanes, tropical storms, or rising rivers may be significantly more contaminated than flood waters from clean sources, such as potable water or rainwater that leaks into buildings. The S500 Standard and Reference Guide for Professional Water Damage Restoration, published by the Institute of Inspection, Cleaning, and Restoration, categorizes water by level of contamination, from potable water, Category 1, to grossly contaminated water, Category 3. The IICRC considers all water originating from seawater, ground or surface water, rising rivers and streams, and wind-driven rain from hurricanes and tropical storms to be Category 3. Before the storm, you should have located your insurance policy and taken the necessary steps to protect your home. Your policy likely states that you have a duty to mitig mitigate, which in general terms means to begin minimizing the loss as much as possible and as quickly as possible. This would include opening doors and windows, assuming it's not still raining, and removing, por removing porous materials that are affected by the flood. If the water damage is minimal, then begin cleaning hard surfaces with a 3% solution of hydrogen peroxide, brown, light-sensitive bottle from any grocery or drugstore. We don't recommend the use of bleach, mainly because too many injuries are reported each year because of its use, and also FEMA, CDC, EPA, and the IICRC are not in agreement with its use either. After this, allow the insurance companies and professional restoration professionals to do their job. And now for the quote of the week. Corey Ten Boom writes, Worry does not empty tomorrow of its sorrow. It empties today of its strength. Did you know? This was said by my mamma, who's a big fan of the vlog. When potion stamps stick together, try placing them in the freezer for about 10 minutes. They should come apart without damaging the glue. Okay, we can't come up with something clever and witty for this segment, so let's call it our five-star picks. Especially since we are still in the hurricane se season, you should call Nate Coco at State Farm. They save my parents a lot of money when I started driving, and they'll be glad to review your policies and try and save you money too. One thing Jennifer at State Farm pointed out was, the previous company overinsured us by adding the property value into the house's value. Think about this. When Dorothy's house flew from Kansas to Oz, the farmland didn't go anywhere. We'll add Team Coco to the comments below. Give them a call. Our services include carpet, upholstery, area rugs, tile and grout cleaning, as well as consulting on carpet-related issues. It's how cleaning is done. It's how cleaning is done. Bye!